head on back. We didn't get the... <laughs> Whoops, we also did not get the thing in that area. <laughs> Sorry, um, in my wandering around I found it right as Snapped was finished uh, looking it up. So, you know, timing. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so, definitely can't get there from here. Try to go in from here. for reaching the other one again. Oh, right, it's a one-way route. <laughs> Whoops. There we go. Well, looks like the thing I never did was that. And there's not even a treasure chest in that area. Wow, go past me. Okay, so I need something bigger to get through that. Snapped, let me know what that bigger thing is while I meander around over here. Oh, Big Block needs the friends. Well then, let us call them. Thank you. Okay, seriously. Do you mind? Yo, Red, get in line. There we go. Okay, I think that's good. Nope, nope. Not quite. Now I can leave you guys behind again. Where the heck did that ability come from? Don't know, don't care, but I'll take it. Alright, so... Presumably, the treasure chest is very easy to find. Good, good. And, if I am not mistaken, that finally does it for Area 2. Hooray! That was only super goddamn annoying. And we 
can't, uh, <laughs> spit water to break the blocks. Gotta find a different exit. Although I don't know why I'm doing that, since I can just do this. Alright, so... Well, I guess, um... <laughs> pick a number, because... Uh, again, we can go absolutely anywhere. We are done with the first... Well, area two and three now. Four, we still have to get to. Five, we are... Well, that is a one-way entrance, so five, we are done with up until the point we get through area eight. So four, six, seven, eight, or nine. What do you guys think? Where to next? Makes absolutely no difference where we go. We have a thing to get over there, so good to know on that. Eight is... I should have gone the other way. Eight is the Radish Ruins. out which area do we have to go into to get to 8, because that may be the deciding factor. Oh, we can get there from Area 3. Actually, Area 3 is the only way we can get there, so... Yeah, that's Area 7. May as well, though, just to get those, uh... And, while we're at it... I'll take that. Thank you very much. Let's go down here. There we go. And hey, we are actually... Bam! Right in Area 8. Cool. Alright, going this way. down into the Radish Ruins. Like it's a rather mazy area. And uh, an area with a lot of uh, one direction pathways. Mm. Well, that's annoying. Are we in room 3 already? We are in room 3 already. I need something that can pound that, so maybe. Mm, no hammer marked on the thing. And no st well, stone wouldn't be marked out of thing, but that's okay. Alright, so yes. Don't need to worry about anything else up there at the moment. This one go. Oh, it goes directly to 
treasure chest, which is, um, yeah, just some health. Nothing special. I was kind of expecting it to take me... Oh, it did take me directly back to the same spot. Just below all the blocks. Which is handy. I'm just, um, double-checking on... Oh! Well, <laughs> unexpected, but hey, sure. just want to really quickly double-check and find out if this door up here will go any place different. Hmm, does not seem like it does. That, however, totally does go to a different place. But now we don't actually want to do that yet. First, we should set up the shortcut to get back here, so that, you know, I don't have to go through so much nonsense each and every time. Is this the right way? I don't think this is the right way. No, definitely not. This is the right way. Huzzah! Okay. It looks like one of the last things we'll be getting in this area is the map, so that's annoying. Let's head back to the other stuff first. Hmm. Kinda surprised there were no, uh, block-ins in that area there, with all those blocks. Seems like the expected thing. Curious how we activate that. Oh well. Figure it out later. As we do the exact same thing. be amazingly nice if you didn't bash into an angle. Yeah, I could have taken the wheel, but who cares? It's not necessary. Nifty nifty, very easy find. And that is the green and orange color spray. Interesting combination. here first. And we can um, get some goodies and I can have an ability that won't have me crashing into things quite so much. Oh, 
quite where we want to go immediately, though. Let's get that first. Sorry, just getting some links in the chat open for later on, because they do seem cool. Okay, no point to that whatsoever. And that's the upwards path. We don't want to be going upwards. Okay, nothing at all. <laughs> Should have seen that coming. And that as well. Nope, don't actually care about that. This is what we care about down here. Alright, now that we have the smash ability, we can, you know, deal with all of the things. So all the things that require hammer or gray blocks or all the other nonsense. Totally taken care of by one single ability. Since we are on this uh, one-way path now, may as well just keep uh, heading along it and get to the boss. Mm, and what's over here? Nothing! Awesome. And yeah, this is the path that will not lead to the map, but that's okay. This will lead to the uh, area boss and the shard, so... You know, worthwhile to uh, head down this way. Or, yes, up this way, as it were. Ah, lovely. Okay, that was... totally pointless. Mm, were the, uh... Sorry, the uh, chat is talking about Legend of Zelda monsters. Were the Goria mole people? I thought they were more like weasel people, or ferret people, or something. Yeah, it could be badgers. Pretty sure we're still going the right way. Although evidently there is 
treasure chest, which I did, didn't notice right down there. It'll be annoying, but that'll work. And it's Meta Knight! We don't need to uh, grab a sword to fight for once. Which actually works out amazingly well with keeping our smash ability. Hm. Didn't think I had gotten through that without being hit, but uh, yeah, we'll go with that. Uh, don't even care to see your animation, Meta Knight. Much more interested in um, clearing out this area. This away. What is this? Mm. <laughs> More artwork of the Goria. entrance, actually, in order to uh, get back to the earlier spot, but we'll find out. No, oh, nope, nope, we definitely don't. There we go. Additional help. Sense. And well, may as well. If I had been paying attention, I would have done this already, but. Oh, great. That is the other thing. not a treasure chest in that area, so back we go. There is only one pathway- no, there are two pathways, excuse me. One to go to, um, open up that little tiny spot into area five, which is basically just for map completion's sake. There is not really any necessity in opening it for, you know, actual reasons of we really need the Area 5 shortcut. More that it's just a thing what we can do. And then there is the uh, final spot we can get to. Hmm. 
And yes, lovely little escape route there. Yep, and that goes back to Carrot Castle. So yes, Area 5 is now officially done. I guess we do have to actually uh, do that. So once again, back here. I mean, we could have just taken the route back again, but uh, still would have had to go through a bit of stuff either way. So it rounds out to be about the same amount of time in uh, getting back to exactly this spot right here. Now we want to go up. Yes, definitely up. This was not the fastest way to get up, but hey, why not? Hmm. Well, it really wants me to take the burning ability, but I'm gonna say I don't care. I have Smash. Smash may not be perfectly suited to this exactly, but it's better suited to everything else, just about. And there are no fuses that need to be lit, so yeah. Good, good, good. Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> All right, and we are exactly where we want to be. Somewhere down here, there will be a door. Which will lead directly... No. Not that we really need it, but still. <laughs> Where is this door? Is this the door? Looks like this is, in fact, the door. Alright. wonder, can we? Hmm. Auto fire is not as effective as I would have hoped. I wonder. Yeah. <laughs> Not worth it. Let's just take the long way around. Hmm. Interesting. Where does that lead, I wonder? Can't be to anything important, because this one is marked as clear, it doesn't have anything to reach, and um, yeah. That'll be the method for that, thank you. There's our map, finally, now that we have literally two rooms left unexplored. And yeah, we could have gone here earlier, but, uh, really wanted the Smash ability, so... Yep, 
up, if you don't mind, at Lair. Let's just find out. Where the heck? Ahem. Where the heck does this lead? It leads to another place. Right in here. So maybe that is required to, um... Do a thing to... No, it's just... What, 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 what? Well, what even is the point of that? Why would you go to the trouble of wasting your smash to get to a place that... Okay, Kirby designers, you kind of failed on that one. That is, um... That is just terrible. There is absolutely no point whatsoever to that cannon. Mini boss. And we're done with area eight. Okay, and yeah, that is one more area entirely complete, and I think that is good for Kirby. We've already been playing this for an hour. Alright, so... Four areas left to go. We are at the halfway point now. So yeah, we will get back to this at some point later, and we will figure out which of these other areas we want to go explore next. Since, again, it doesn't matter in the least which ones we go to when. Although I'm kind of thinking Candy Constellation would be a good one to do next, since we have already gotten that halfway explored. But we'll figure it out next time.